Hi everybody, this is uh, Silvio Canto in Dallas, Texas on Friday, February the 2nd. Welcome to our video commentary. It appears that today, Friday, or in the next couple of days, that the so-called memo, the big memo, is going to be made public so that uh, the American people can see this memo. There's obviously a lot of political controversy going on, and you, you would expect that. I mean, that's not anything, anything that we have not seen before. Now, obviously, I have not read this memo. People who I trust, whose judgment I trust, have seen the memo, and they are very troubled by what's in this memo or the information or the allegations of what's in this memo. The allegation is very simple. They, what they're basically saying is that law enforcement or the agencies of the federal government, the powers that we grant the federal government to protect us, like FISA and warrants and wiretapping and all of these things, that uh, they were used for political reasons. Now, I have always supported FISA. I have always supported uh, anything that the federal government can do to protect me and my family from a terrorist attack or for, from other type of uh, criminal activity. So I'm okay with granting the federal government these powers that they will use responsibly to protect me and you and everybody else. But it does appear, and again, I have not seen it, but people I trust in the House and in the government have seen this information and they're very troubled by what they have seen. Now, my guess is that the memo will come out on, on probably Monday. I have a funny feeling that they'll hold it they're going to hold it until after the Super Bowl. I, I think that right now, to put it out Friday, uh, would compete with the Super Bowl. So they're better off waiting until Monday or Tuesday. That is from a timing standpoint, because there's not going to be as much in the news. But anyway, whenever they release it, I think we will find out just the extent uh, of what the information is. If it turns out to be just a lot of hot air and nothing, well, then that's what we will learn. But if only half of the allegations turn out to be true, just half of it, I think there are some very serious questions. Uh, my guess is that because it'll become a big political controversy, my guess is that the Attorney General will call for an independent counsel. And uh, even though I don't like independent counsels, uh, I think that's where we're going. And you're going to have an independent counsel, and then they're going to look at this and see what happened. But again, if only half of, of what is alleged is true, then, you know, I think there's some serious problems here. Of course, the allegation is uh, that uh, the Obama administration used a fake or fake information or politicized information, whatever you want to call it, to obtain a FISA warrant to uh, listen or to tap into or to investigate a U.S. citizen. That's very dangerous. Uh, it's extremely dangerous, and that's something that has to be investigated. And if it's true, that's, again, that's very serious, and I, I don't think anybody should be defending it. Now, a lot of people, a lot of people are so invested in their hatred of Trump that, you know, they, they just see everything uh, as Trump is evil or Trump is bad or whatever. And to me, this has nothing to do with Trump. This has to do with whether or not these extreme powers are, that, that we give the federal government, if these powers are being used for political reasons. If they are, then that's wrong. That's just plainly wrong. And the people behind this need to be investigated and prosecuted uh, if that's necessary. So we'll keep an eye on the memo. But again, is, if only half of this memo is correct or what people are saying is in, is in this memo, we got some serious problems. And some people need to be held uh, need to be held accountable for this uh, for this action thank you for watching we have all of this over at YouTube uh, also on my Twitter and also on my blog have a great day everybody and regarding the Super Bowl I think the Patriots are going to win they're not necessarily my favorite team but I think the Patriots are going to win and we'll see what happens after that uh, you know you have to wonder sometimes how long is Tom Brady going to play and uh, maybe this is uh, this is the end of it but uh, you know, I think they're going to win. I just think they're so good that they're going to win. But the Eagles could have an upset. I mean, a lot of people probably want the Eagles to win just to, to have an upset. Uh, neither one of these teams is my favorite team. So I just want a good game. And I don't want any politically correct commercials either. So I'll just put it that way. 
Have a wonderful day, everybody, and we'll talk to you later.